Okay, so I love sharing these videos with you guys where I'm showing you like my cleaning routine and my grocery pickup. Like every single week, I really love sharing that with you guys. And I wanted like all the things that I eat in a day, etc., etc. So just really quick in this cleaning video, I'm gonna go through a grocery haul with you guys to show you what I got for the lake this weekend. So this weekend at the lake, we are um, bringing along my in-laws, so they're going to be staying with us in our camper, and I needed to get a few extra groceries. So I wanted to kind of show you some of the cheap stuff that I'll get, but still trying to stay on like the healthy side as far as like for Weight Watchers and things like that. Okay, so first, things first. Um, we always have chips at the lake. Um, if I do have chips, I try to just have them like one day um, and then I will limit how much I have because I do get really bloated from chips. Um, but they're nice for like guests, right? Because not everybody that you're with is going to want to be dieting. So I've got two bags of potato chips. I got the store brand because they were like on super sale this week. And honestly, potato chips, like they all taste the same to me. Um, I'm bringing the kids over to my neighbor's house today and we're gonna go swimming swimming in their pool before we go to the lake. So um, I grabbed a couple of bags of hot dog buns, one for the lake, one to bring over to my neighbor's house because um, I'm gonna bring some hot dogs with. Um, and then, like, and for me, just so you guys know, um, if we do hot dogs, like I might just eat a hot dog. I know they're high in points. Um, but another really good alternative is chicken sausage. Chicken sausage is really yummy, and I believe I found one that was like a Chipotle Monterey Jack today um, at my local grocery store. So good, but they've got chicken sausage everywhere. Um, and then for breakfast, I will usually just do like scrambled eggs, things like that, but um, breakfast sandwiches are a really easy breakfast when you're out at the lake and they're super filling. I can then just do like some scrambled eggs with a piece of like turkey bacon and then be like on and about my day. Um, and then I am keeping this at the house. This is cottage cheese. Um, we've really been liking cottage cheese lately with our breakfast. And I picked up some more sliced cheese to keep out at the lake. Um, and we'll just throw this like in the community pile. I believe these are like three or four points or maybe even five points per slice. So these are a little bit higher. I do prefer provolone, but when I'm hosting guests, I like to cater more so to them than to myself. So I make something that's called Minnesota Crack Dip and it's one large container of top the tater, one large container of sour cream mix, with a, a bag of bacon bits and a handful of finely shredded cheese. Mix it all together and dip it with potato chips. It is the best dip ever, you guys. It is so good. Um, not super great for a diet, but um, you could probably find like a fat-free version of this kind of sour cream. I'm not sure on the top of tater or like a fat-free French onion dip would do the trick to um, mix those together because that would be much more Weight Watchers friendly. Um, I will just be very careful of how much I have of this. I'll just kind of have like a little dip here and there throughout the day, like up to a couple, a couple of tablespoons so I'm not like reaching too many points, but just enough to like give yourself that treat, give yourself a little bit of a taste, especially if you're being active. Like for me, I'm at the lake all day, if I have a couple of chips while I'm at the lake all day and I'm running around like crazy, I'm a little bit more lenient with myself. So 80, 20, 90, 10, whatever you guys can live by. 80% healthy, 90% healthy, just be as healthy as you possibly can be, but give yourself some treats. Um, and then here's those hot dogs I was talking about. Um, I picked up some hamburger buns. We have a thing of frozen patties out at the lake cabin that we're going to be using. So um, those are already there, but I needed some hamburger buns. Um, I will just wrap mine in some romaine, and I've got romaine in the fridge that I will bring along with us. Um, and then I got um, the, the like dull mixed berry frozen fruit. Um, what I like to use this for is acai bowls super good with this frozen fruit, but also skinny margaritas. I will just do a little bit of this along with some limeade like this. And then I will do um, tequila, and it usually equates to be about six points per tall glass for a margarita. Super good, I know it's still high in sugar, but it's summertime and I like to have my margs still at the lake, so this is a good alternative for margaritas. Um, and then I always pick up these slip gyms to 
told you guys, it's like my weird weakness. I like love Slim Jims, but four of these are like five points, so they're not very high in points. And the kids love them too, so they're just a good snack to have around in the house. Um, and then I picked up two packages of eggs, um, one to keep at the house, and then one I will be bringing out to the lake cabin. Um, here's those bacon bits for the dip, and another thing of hot dogs. One thing of hot dogs I'm bringing to my neighbor's house, like I said. The other thing of hot dogs I'm bringing out to the lake. So, all right. That is going to wrap it up for this mini little like shopping haul. Um, I do just quickly want to show you some other things that I'm going to be throwing in um, that I had on hand, just in case you guys want some more ideas of like what we really eat when we're out at the lake cabin. So let's flip the camera around and I will show you some more stuff. So one thing that I will reach for a lot of the times is bananas. I will bring bananas out to the lake with me because I like to make banana pancakes. I like to make those banana pancake muffins with the Kodiak cake mix. If you guys haven't seen that recipe, I will leave it in the comments down below because it's bomb diggity and it's only weight, one Weight Watchers point. It's super good. So, um, and then over here, this is where I keep my oranges and my kids go through at least one a day. So I will always grab a couple of oranges from this bowl as well to bring out to the lake. All right, and then this time around, I am going to be bringing this watermelon out because this needs to be eaten up. Um, I do have some orange juice I might bring that with. Um, and then I also have a whole watermelon up on top here inside my fridge that I'll bring and um, romaine hearts and I might just bring like one romaine heart out and then one tomato out because we're only gonna be there for tonight and then tomorrow so we're not gonna be we're not gonna be there for very long um, but you guys know that one of my go-to's for on Weight Watchers is a chicken breast with tomato in a romaine lettuce heart with a tablespoon of mayo it's only three points and it's super filling and I don't ever feel bloated from it
I know you guys watch these videos for cleaning inspiration, but I'll tell you what. Okay, let me tell you what though. Today, I am completely lacking any motivation. I'm super stressed today for just like a million different reasons. Having a high anxiety day, so I'm trying to just swallow that anxiety and move forward and like try to get all of this done. I have so much to do. And my computer is not working, which is super awesome. But just wanted to come on here and tell you guys that even if you're having a really unmotivational day, that you can still push through it. If you're not feeling it, you can push through it and still get it done. Get everything you need to get done off your list and move on with your day. So I'm ready to get to the lake. I'm ready to have some fun. So I'm going to fold some laundry, pack up the bags, get into my swimsuit, and then I'm gonna head over to my neighbor's house. We're gonna go swimming for a couple hours in their pool, and then we're going to go to the lake. So, yes, I know. Even I lack the motivation. <laughs>
All right, you guys, that is going to wrap it up for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this tidy up, clean with me, pack with me, and little grocery haul. This is my routine every single Thursday or Friday before we head out to the lake. I make sure that everything is ready to go for the weekend so we come back to a clean house. The laundry is done. Um, here I did not fold all of the laundry, but that is okay. All right, you guys, please give this video a big, huge thumbs up if you liked it. Share it on your socials. Subscribe to my channel before you leave so that you don't miss out on any of my other videos here on my channel. And I will see you guys tomorrow for a day in the life. Okay, bye you guys.